Okay everyone, so for our equation we have y equals 2 over 3x, which means for our graph we have to go up 2 and then over 3, which gives us our slope. You guys understand? Alright. All right, yeah, I actually get it. Yeah. This okay, is so then we need to find the derivative by using the limit process, obviously. So we take one over x squared, plug into the formula, simplify it down, and then we should. Whoa, be whoa, whoa, hold on! Where'd you get that? Which, uh, which part are you asking? I'm confused. The, the, the entire thing. I don't even know what that is. Oh, we just went over this. Were you not listening? No, we didn't. How did we go from linear equations to tangent line derivatives? Guys, you understand this, right? N no, we don't. Yeah, I understand it. See, this one singular guy gets it, which automatically means you all do know it as well. Right. Okay, so if I move 10 meters in five seconds, my average velocity is going to be two meters per second. Do you all understand that? Okay. Okay, I got it. So I get then taking the formula for quantum mechanics and then multiplying it by space, time, and gravity, you should be able to do All right, everyone good? No. No, we're not good. How do we do it?